just so you know, I am uploading this out of spite, because many of you do not know how to lure any super, let alone a super moth. So I will show you right now. And just as I was recording this, some son of a bitch decided to lure it away without a bulb. This is what I and many other players that know how to lure a moth have to deal with. And then sometimes they lose it because of that. Step 1. Equip, rubber and bulb. Preferably common bulb because you do not want any unnecessary roaches coming after you. Step 2. Equip the best herd you have because, again, you do not want any unnecessary spiders or flies on you. Step 3. Locate the moth. Step 4. Safely hit the moth. When you get the chance, move all other moths out of the way because, believe me, other moths are a blockade. Step 5. Frequently equip and unequip the bulb, usually under the turd. Make sure you do this whilst not rushing or luring any roaches because you do not want this. Step 6. Make sure you don't lose the moth. Don't just rush to wherever you're going to because you will lose the moth. Step 7. Lure it to the egg squad of your choosing. If there are no egg squads, lure it here. Unless it already spawned here, then you don't have to do that. Just kill it. But here's someone who did lure it to the long corridor. Not me, but someone else did. And if this happens, kill any pre-existing monsters that are in front of the super moth. Then you can kill it. Honestly, just kill them all if you can. It will make super hunting a lot easier and a lot more efficient. Step 8. Equip and unequip the bulb when needed. Preferably to remove all of the ultra monsters that you lured towards this stack. Otherwise, the squad will die and you will lose your potential to mythic drop. And step 9, and I believe this is the most important step, DO NOT FUCKING DIE! Because unless you want this to be chaotic, everyone's going to die, or the moth will be lost. One of the two. Keep equipping and unequipping bulb until it's dead, and make sure you do not lure the super roach that has just spawned. I'll let others lure the roach as I'm luring the moth. And this is how you lure the moth. PROFESSIONALLY! To those that are terrible at luring, do you understand now? Do you also understand how spiteful I am just to actually show this to you? Well, regardless, I hope someone has learned something from this so that we don't have to deal with much of this shit again. Maybe I'll do fly or roach next, but that's only if I get sick and tired of many of you trying to be good lurers and failing in the process. Now, did you learn anything from this? Yes? No? I don't really care. This is just a video that you may or may not watch, so enjoy, or don't. That is really up to you.